Good afternoon, amigos from Mexico City. Today, in today's video, Hiller and I get up close and personal with art in the city, and that really uh, got me to thinking. And I wanted to echo a point that one of you made in a section in the comment section, and that is Mexico City, in and of itself, is a museum. Just between the buildings, the art in the street, the statues, the sculptures, the parks. Just the, the sheer history within the city itself is amazing, and hopefully you can you can feel some of that in uh, in this street art video. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Good morning, amigos from Mexico City. Today we are hanging out with street art Chilongo, and this is Hinaro, and this is uh, he started this company. So first of all, tell us a little bit about what you guys do. Well, we basically what we do is that we take pictures of street art and we put them online. We also happen to do a tour, which is the one you're going on. Yep. And then we also have to, sometimes we go on paint walls just because we like it. Okay, <laughs> it looks like what you're doing today. So uh, for a wall about this size, how long will this take you? No, we'll just be finishing like in three hours. Three oh, hours? Oh, jeez. Jeez, that's crazy. And about how many cans of spray paint will you go through? Well, th for this one, it's going to be like really colorful, so we brought a lot of paint. A lot of paint, okay. And where did you learn how to paint? Well, I, I started painting on the streets in Berlin back in the oh, year wow. 2010. Wow. Okay. And uh, from there, from then on. Okay. Wow, that's and really cool. And what is your favorite thing to paint? Is it lots of color? Is it abstract? Is it, what is it like? I like to paint things that like interact with the public you know, okay. or that make you feel like, what the hell is this on the street? <laughs> or, or yeah. that, that surprises you. That's, that's the kind of things that I like to do. Sure. Okay, last and most <laughs> important question. What is your favorite Mexican food? <laughs> oh, chilaquiles. Chilaquiles. Or okay. agua chile. Agua chile. Okay, perfect. All right. Nice to meet you. We'll come back and get a shot of the final product later. <laughs> yes. Perfect. Thank you. Okay, we've just barely started the tour. We're only about 10 minutes in. But something that I found very interesting already is that street art is made with all different sorts of materials. So we've seen spray paint, which is what I would think all street art was made from. We saw stenciling, we saw different like, uh, like yeah, uh, on uh -huh. sort of, um, I'm not sure. I don't know what called. it was called. We've seen stenciling. Pla like plastered. Plastered. <laughs> uh, so it's interesting to me all the different mediums and techniques uh, and how diverse street art can be. Now then, we have an hour and 50 minutes left to explore. <laughs> There's some art that uh, we can't show here on uh, here on camera. Uh, there's we're only showing art that has been kind of approved by or approved by the Chilango Street Art uh, guys or or that work with the street the Chilango Street Art people because uh, apparently there's there's some different rivalries and different beef and whatnot in the in the street art scene. So, uh, so we don't want to show too much other people. So the one behind me is actually one we can't show, but. Uh, while they're talking, one thing I wanted to say that I really appreciate about the street art is that, uh, I mean, you need permission to do it, but I think you don't need to go to a museum, it's not fancy, it's anybody can access it, and it's similar to what I think is social media these days. You don't have to be a pro to create something. You don't need to be Steven Spielberg to try and make a film. You just need, we started off with like a $100 camera and just just try something, just upload it for anybody to see and who knows what will happen. So it's one thing I so far appreciate about the street art we've seen. Towards the end of the tour, we have seen a lot from uh, people that we've met today. I have shook, I've shaken the hand of some of these artists. And when I get a blank canvas, 
<laughs> I'm going to town. Uh -oh. <laughs> Belton, Texas. <laughs> and um, I'm not educated in this uh, in this realm of the art world at all. So it's been very interesting to learn about street art, the difference between graffiti versus street art, how these two um, sort of artists, uh, how they work on the streets, literally. <laughs> and uh, just the styles of all the different artists are so insanely, it's such a diverse community and everyone's style, just like other artwork we've seen. but. Um, it's been cool to learn about the artists, their reputation in the city, um, you know, whether they paint or create things that are um, about social perspectives or political perspectives or for fun or for children. It's been really interesting to learn all about it. The real reason I taped that little beginning section of today's video is because we completely deleted the outro video in which we gave you our final thoughts about the tour and uh, and all that fun stuff. I put it in a different video, deleted that video, so she gone. But obviously, we had a, a lot of fun, uh, a lot of fun looking at all the street art within the city. There was a lot that we couldn't show you on camera, uh, so we encourage you when you come to Mexico City just to. Just to walk around, we were mostly in the Roma uh, neighborhood. I can kind of, I can put you in touch with the street art guys, and uh, they can tell you exactly where we're at. But uh, we had a lot of fun, and more importantly, we have some bonus footage coming up for you. So be sure to watch that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, click the bell that way you get notified. Every time we upload a new video, and we will see you mañana. Mañana, adios. The people what we have. People? <laughs> we have concha. Concha. They uh, chuck a lot. I want Ooh. Oh man, all we're missing is a cafe con leche. I want the I want the show I want to show the other one. Hashtag bonus footage. Okay. <laughs> okay, amigos. In English, porfa. Here. Okay, friends. <laughs> we have oh. conche. No, this needs so Spanish. De concha de, de vanilla con nata. Con nata. But con really, it's con todo. <laughs> con todo. Instead of con nada. <laughs> con nada. <laughs> that looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag thumbnail. <laughs> Here, we have the biggest chocolate cigar you've ever seen. <laughs> I think that's the same kind Winston Churchill used. Oh my gosh. What is it? What's it taste like? Handmade ice cream cone oh. full of nata dipped in chocolate. Oh, mama. The people in front of us were getting probably a hundred. They had a lot. Of these, and they were making more, so good choice. Hashtag bonus footage. Hashtag hasta mañana.